hello everybody I am the Arkham one and I just want to make a quick note or semi quick I don't know how long this is gonna be if you're looking for the slab that's okay let's turn the audio down so I can act I just wanted to talk about not really like the, just the current state of the channel but how I'm I am with this channel and I just want to say that I'm proud to be where I am I always am do I think that this could be more always and I always keep trying to improve it as much as I can and that's why I'm gonna try a little bit harder on these edited videos it might take a little bit while longer who knows because it's hard to balance out my life outside of YouTube and what I do for YouTube that's, a, that's why I've always used the excuse of live streaming to have content on this channel to the point I'm very happy where I am and I only think I can improve by me I if I want to improve that I gotta show I am capable of improving myself and improving how I am and how the content of this channel is. Of course, I can make the excuse that you guys can make the channel better, which you guys always do, but I can't, like, leave it up to people to improve the state of this channel. It has to be me. At least for right now, because there's not gonna be, like, some kind of humongous breakthrough on this channel. I'm not gonna be shouted out by some big top YouTuber or celebrity like some YouTubers have to give like a nice jump start. That stuff doesn't happen to everybody and I don't expect it to happen. At one point I kinda did. But I'm gonna have to do a lot of work and I realize that. And I think I can do it. And all I need is just what I've been getting your continuous support and it's awesome to be able to be supported by this amount already I just now got to the point where I'm happy again of where it's going because after I came back I wasn't happy but I knew I had to do something I wasn't happy with this channel I was getting out of focus, out of motivation, influence, everything that I was working on. I gave up in just a second. Everything's starting to look bad. And I can't do that. I realize I can do better than that. I am capable of so much more. And it's about time I showed it. So I'm going to go back to do a lot more work. And it's thanks to you guys for showing me that I can do it. So, deeply, thank you. But on a more serious note, instead of looking at me killing people by shooting them in the face multiple times, I... it's just... I was at a point where I still felt like giving up even when I came back. I didn't know what to do. I I realized that as soon as I left, everything broke down. Now that I have felt more confident, felt better about myself, and about the state of this channel, I realized that I'm still growing. And I'm not talking about myself, I'm talking about the channel, but we, this channel, is growing. Slowly, yes very slowly but at that part don't matter what matters is that it's improving bit by bit and I'm happy about it I am extremely happy about it when it comes to the songs that I used to do I have always said that I wanted to do them I said them in previous videos that I want to keep doing the songs I'm gonna figure out how in the world I'm gonna do songs again and I haven't been really trying, even though I said I would. I'll be honest, I haven't really tried. I'm not even sure if I should do them anymore. <laughs> I'm not sure it was worth it. But 
it in some ways it just ain't and maybe that's me not having hardly anything to actually show that I was that it was awesome that it was worth it that people enjoyed it I didn't see that some of you actually cared about it I didn't see that and I kind of still don't but I realized a little bit more than I did so that's maybe my bad on my part but I just couldn't see it I don't know I don't know how I'm going to get the songs out there and I have a feeling that I'm going to have to use a different app instead of Music Maker Jam. Even though I had a lot of fun using Music Maker Jam, I always felt like I'm not actually making music because I'm still using other work that is free royalty. But it doesn't really show that I can make my own thing. I'm just using... I'm just using other pieces of work dividing it and calling it my own and it still works it's still free royalty the ones that I put up on YouTube are all free royalty stuff that I won't that I shouldn't get claimed for but I've gotten like copyright notices on them before because certain parts sounded like everyone else's like some other person it may sound kind of similar but that's just because it's using different loops that are used for everyone. That everyone can use the same blue. They can just change the tune of it. You may not even know what I'm talking about. For the people who don't know or understand what I just said, basically some parts of the song sound like everyone else's. So it's not 100% my own work, even though it's free royalty and I just use it. Free royalty means it's not going to get copyrighted. Which is good. Sort of. It d doesn't give me an excuse to not try to use everything 100% by myself. So I'm going to try that. I, I'm still happy. I am, I am going to be featuring more and more things. I have all kinds of games planned. I got series planned. I got series I might even go back to. Like Undertale. I might figure out how to come back to that even though I kind of skipped ahead a little bit. <laughs> so it's not really 100% blind anymore. Then again it never was because Undertale is like a very well-known game. There's spoilers that I already know about because, well, it's all over the internet. Stuff like that. So, yeah. So, when I'm talking about the collaborations, I got this Borderlands Duo livestream series that I absolutely enjoy. He is so much fun to play with. And I feel happy making that kind of content with other people, and I'm going to keep continuing that. Me and him are going to see if we can try something I've been trying to do all over again, which is getting other people into this YouTube thing, or Twitch, or whatever, and we can all be like a little team together. And we can always make videos on all kinds of different games, have fun. It's going to be super... It's going to be amazing if this actually pulls through, and I really hope it does. And it's been awesome. The Minecraft with Peter, or Military Man 1415, that's been awesome too, except the part of me losing half my footage, so I had to, so it took a little bit while to make part two, which I'm currently working on right now. So you guys who actually been watching that series, I'm sorry, but I'm working on it. Don't worry, I'm not going to give it up, because I'm having a lot of fun. Now... Here's something that I'm going to plan on doing, and this is something that will happen. This is something that's going to happen, and it, I don't know if you guys will like this or not, but it's just better for me, my own sake, and it makes more sense. I've been doing live streams on YouTube. That's pretty 
well known. Half my videos are probably live streams at this point. M maybe not that much, but there's quite a bit. And I'm thinking about transitioning to Twitch. My friends are going to Twitch because they don't like the editing and stuff. And I love editing, but it does take a long time to edit some things. I'm currently going to take classes next year on media and video production for CTC. If any of you are from Ohio, you know what that little school is for juniors and uh, seniors. So that's I'm going to be taking some classes on that and probably classes on digital designing to make some work on all kinds of other stuff. Like, I don't just do YouTube video game videos or music. I don't just do that. I do a lot of different stuff. I'm for uh, my good friend Chris as a prototype, whoever you want to call him, his actual Twitch name is that Temper Gaming. So I'm going to start calling him by Temper now because it makes more sense, sort of. Because it's his YouTube n or and uh, Twitch name, so I made him a logo and banner, all that fun stuff that you guys will probably see uh, later on. Maybe he will talk to you guys about it. But I had a lot of fun making that. Out of the blue, I stopped whatever I was doing and said, "Yeah, I'll work on that." And I've never done it before, but I had a fun time trying to make it, and he absolutely loved it in the end. So. I'm currently working on all kinds of other things at the same time. And I'm getting out of... I'm losing my point here. But the point is, I'm going to be transitioning to Twitch soon, like sometime by February. Or whenever we complete the Borderlands 2 series with my good pal, Fat Temper Gaming. Link is going to be down in the description to his Twitch account. And you'll see his live streams and... If you don't want to see mine, or you just want to see both views, if that's what you're into and you got nothing else better to do, go ahead. I won't stop you. But I don't recommend it. So, yeah. I'm sorry if you guys just love YouTube, but my live streaming is going to go to Twitch. And here's a note, I'm not giving up on YouTube saying this. I will live stream on YouTube every now and then. I'm not going to do all live streams on Twitch, but most of them are going to appear there from now on. So, I am sorry, and I hope you guys are not so... I hope you guys aren't so upset about that. I'm happy to where this channel is going, as I said. And there's a lot more to come. I can't wait. It's going to take forever to continue this and and it's gonna be less uploads by a little bit because it's hard to record things but I will still try my best even with having high school to deal with all the time and ow I'm trying to be expected to try to do every single thing they tell me to do in school which is not gonna happen but I will try my best but I'm still going to have all the time in the world for this. I'm never going to give this up, no matter what. And I want to say also congratulations on this little milestone of making it all the way to 170 subscribers. I was so upset that I was stuck at the 160 range for the longest time for about, I don't know, five, six months? I don't know, I'll look that up because it's been a while since I actually gained. I was stuck at the 160 range ever since I took that break. And that was a while ago. So that break and me going, getting stuck like that was my fault. The live streams really did help uh, back then and they still do now. But I gotta start getting people's attention other ways than just live streams for this channel. I'll always do go on Twitch and that'll get me recognition on the channels as well. I'll make sure to mention it in most streams, I guess. I don't know. I don't have a, I don't have like this plan going on. I'm winging it half the time. But it's still, but that's how I want to do things. It's, it feels comfortable for me to try and do it like this. So. I'm happy where I am. I will always continue this. 
I am very, very proud of how you guys have been, how I've been, and everything. How I want them this off is a really big thank you to all of you who have given me this chance to continue this. <laughs> I, as I've always said, I wouldn't be here without you guys. You guys are awesome. The people who, who either stay around for like one video, say hi, or just watch a little bit of it. Give everyone who gives that one like. Everyone who, who looks at me and say, hey, you're doing a good job. Or just hey in general, just saying that. That makes me feel amazing. It's awesome. It's awesome getting any kind of support. I would not be here without you. And it's been fun. I will continue this as long as you guys are there with me. So thank you. I hope to improve and do more for you guys in the future. And now. See you next time. Uh, I can barely breathe after I talk so fast. Okay. Anyways. Anyway, hi everybody! Will you shut the fuck up and let me do my outro? Going out the corner for this bullshit. Alright, you guys, I'm gonna end up stream here. I will stream tomorrow. Uh, oh. Would you stop? See? See? <laughs> Help me, I don't I wanna lose money. Help me! Right